Today we will learn to draw angles of given measurements using paper folding and protractor. Let's learn it in an interesting way. We will draw a circle on the paper using the compass and cut it accordingly. Do you remember that the circle is an angle of 360 degrees? If we fold the circle in half, we will get an angle of 180 degrees. If we again fold it in half, we will get an angle of 90 degrees. Just think, if we again fold it in half, what angle will we get? Think, think. Yes, we will get an angle of measure 45 degrees if we open the circle. We will see that the circle is divided into 8 parts of 45 degrees each. Can you tell from the three sections what will be the measurement of the angle we get? Think, think. Exactly. We will get an angle measuring 135 degrees. Similarly, which measure of angles can be made using this method? We also use the protractor to draw angles. One block of protractor shows a measurement of 1 degree. Since there are sections from 0 to 180 degrees on the protractor, we can easily draw angles up to 180 degrees. Let's learn the method of making angles using the protractor. Suppose construct an angle of measure 122 degrees. Step 1. First, we draw a line MN. Step 2. By placing the center of the protractor on M, we will adjust the protractor in such a way that its zero edge line is along MN. Step 3. You can see that there are two scales on the protractor. Can you tell which scale do we need to see? Think, think. Absolutely right. We will see the scale at which 0 degree is near the point N. That is, here we will see the inner scale. In this way, we will consider line MN as 0 degrees. Moving forward on this scale, we will see at which place the section 122 degrees falls. We will mark the point L in front of this place. Step 4. Now we will draw a line starting from point M and going to point L. Thus, here we have created the angle LMN measuring 122 degrees. Now you pause the video and create an angle measuring 97 degrees you will definitely be able to do it. Today we learned to draw angles of given measurements using paper folding and protractor. In the next video, we will see how to make angles of special measurement using compass.